Yo, what is up ladies and broke boys? In this video I'm gonna help out the people that live in the warmer parts of the world because I know how you feel when it's hot as hell and you can't dress the way you want. So for places like Hawaii and LA where there are no real seasons, it just gets hot and hotter. So for those of you suffering, I got some tips to stay fashionable in the heat. Fuck Supreme. I'm an eight, nigga. So for the first tip I'd like to give all you sweaty boys is to not be afraid to show some skin. Unless you have a condition that keeps you from being in the sun too long, don't be afraid to show some skin in your outfits. An example is like unbuttoning the top couple buttons on your shirt or cuffing your sleeve. An easy way to start to cuff is your pants. Cuff your pants and wear some no-show socks to keep it breathable. The reason for this is to make it easier for air to circulate around your body so you're not trapping the heat on yourself. If you tend to wear pants a lot, try and switch it up with some shorts. It also keeps in tone with the tropical vibe of living in a generally hot place. Next tip is to keep the color scheme generally light. The heat from the sun is trapped in the darker colors like black and navy, so for places where it's hot, it's not the worst idea to switch up the colors every once in a while. I find that light blue tends to be a great color to work around as it mixes well with both light and dark tones. Depending on how thick the cut is and how well you handle heat, dark denim is still wearable where it's hot. Just feel out how you want to work with it. Personally, I still wear my dark denim when it gets hot, but I've grown to have a high tolerance for heat. Last but not least is to look for a thin undershirt. If you're the type to be self-conscious about your sweat showing, then look for a dry fit or some type of thin material as an undershirt. You won't really feel the shirt after a while and it will help block out the sweat from seeping through your outer layer. I like to use the Under Armour wicking shirt under my outfits to block sweat rings. So I guess you could say it really puts the under in Under Armour. But undershirts go a long way with sweat, so you can do what you need to do without worrying about sweat actually showing through. So, to wrap this up, if you live where it's hot, don't worry, I got you. First thing you gotta do is not be afraid to let some skin show. Just cuff some stuff up and unbutton your shirt a bit and let yourself breathe. Next is to lighten up your color scheme. If you're used to wearing dark tones, switch it up and maybe you won't be so hot all the time. See what fits with you and then work from there. Last is to look into an undershirt. I would prefer the stretchy gym tee type of shirt to put under your button up or t-shirt to keep the sweat from seeping through. You'll feel more confident which will improve your whole day overall. Major key. Alright guys, thanks for watching the video and I hope I was able to keep that sweat off of all your heat. If you liked the video, please reciprocate that by leaving a like and commenting on what you want to see more of. If you have any personal questions, email me at frugalaesthetic at gmail.com and all the other info will be in the description. Again, thanks for watching and have a good day.